Hey yo, <clears throat> all right. We're gonna do me yo. We're gonna do my lions. Yes we are. Yes we are. All right, King John. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious, that was a whole lot. What do you mean? It was just a whole lot. <clears throat> a noise. That's all. Is that the one that leaks? No. Okay. See? So this is gonna be, yeah. This is going to See? be. I, yes, I, I picked up on that one. You um, took a sip, actually. Okay. First half of March 2020, my Leos. My Leos, my Leos, my Leos. Mm -hmm. So you're either lonely or you're not. It's, it's a lesson, right? So if you are lonely, you can get yourself out of it. Know that you're never alone, right? There's always, it's not the same, I get it, but there's always somebody listening. So maybe you had to go through this, I'm not sure. But you certainly, it's a lesson, you certainly don't have to, you can get yourself out of it, okay? I'm attracted to those who serve my highest good, so you're either with somebody that's no good, or you know you need to be, okay? So you're definitely going through a situation ship right now that is linked to partnerships, whether it's work or love. That's a given, okay? And you got freedom at the bottom of the deck, and here you got peace, okay? So releasing negative energy, so you're holding on to something. You're holding on to something, my little Leos. <clears throat> You do want peace. You know, freedom at the bottom of the deck. You got a lot of blue teals. But, you know, it's it's about your own your own happiness. If, if you're in a relationship and you're lonely and there's no peace, then... I, I guess, ouch. You know? And if that's the case, they're making it clear as day that there's an out... <laughs> So, I guess it really just depends. <clears throat> so, Leo, March, first half of March, please. That's way too many. First half of March. many. It's the second time I've seen that go with control issues though, so I don't know if you're trying to control the situation. Worth waiting for. Make the effort. Someone else had worth waiting for. I can't remember. See the Pisces or Scorpio. Damn, this could be the one. All those are like so positive. They hope to miss that you deserve love. Okay, Kaden, turn that down a notch. I'm working. Do you want some earbuds? Okay. Yeah? Sure. Your adapter doesn't work. So, worth waiting for, make an effort. This could be the one. Staying optimistic. You can't say pop and forget the smoke. Wow. That's a whole lot of um, whew, emotions. Kaden, I don't know what you're saying. Please stop. You're crazy. I'm not saying anything. Yeah, it sounded about pop and smoke. Mom, you're crazy. Okay. It's a whole lot of emotion, guys. I'm just trying to get a grip. It's like, this could be the one. It's so, like, I don't know if right now you're by yourself. Something doesn't go right in relationships. It's like you never get the peace you're seeking. Right now you might just want your freedom. You know, I don't, I don't know. Something's divinely orchestrated, though. I don't know if you're worried about competition. Make an effort. This could be the one. Staying optimistic. So you deserve love. So you you obviously never got the whole ten of cups. You never got the whole fulfillment. 
for the first half of March. You deserve it. Look at that. New opportunity and love. Something guided. Pence of pence. Whoa. Whoa. Lovers. Hangman. So you might have to sacrifice something here. Eight of pence. You're definitely doing some type of research. You definitely want a new opportunity. I don't know if there's something going on with work. But it's like, go ahead and offer. Make the effort. This could be the one. So there's somebody on your mind. The thing is, I think you might be in a relationship or you just got out of a relationship. But yeah, you deserve love. You you want that. It's a posse, king of cups. You're definitely doing some type of research here. I don't know what it's regarding. You're trying to stay positive. I feel like this is more... I don't think this is changing your perspective. Well, yeah, if you if it's negative, right? But I feel like it's more... There's like some type of sacrifice involved here. It's just holy emotions. I, I, I got... I, I, Ladies and gents, I can't get over worth waiting for. Make the effort. This could be the one staying optimistic. You deserve love. It's like, whoa. Whoa. Tell me about the Ace of Cups. So you have an opportunity. It's a divine offer. It's a divine partnership. Ace of Cups for lovers. That's definitely a divine partnership worth waiting for. For sure, Zs. You know, something can be healed. It's either that or you want a reconciliation. Either that or you're dealing with a Sag. This is more like reconciliation having the strength to go about it knight of wands sending a message what do we got over here prince of pence tell me about the prince of pence so that's you guys having the strength to heal a situation so something requires attention tell me about the prince of pence you could be dealing with the gemini pisces another leo and a coin so whatever offer you're making you're coming in as a page right but it's like you're offering the ten of coins so it's like it's new but you're more than capable of of setting that type of solid foundation this confidence that type of stuff tell me about the lovers So wanting to go in a direction, choosing a direction, it's just a matter of, of doing it. You're definitely like, is it, is it not? It's like plucking, it's like plucking a, a rose, the rose petals. Does he love me? Does he love me not? Does he love me? Does he love me not? So there's some type of clarity you're going to get with this hangman, this situation. Mental clarity, conversation. Within the next two weeks for sure. Chariot moving forward. Leaving the past behind. Tell me about the eight of pence. Cups like it's like you see someone as an empress. You got the magician here. Tell me about this ten of cups. I don't know 
know if something had to end or you just know something is, is you're happy because the ace is here. So whatever this is you've been holding on to. Look at the two that fell out. The Empress and the Emperor. So this is your happiness. This is your fulfillment. This is not here. Unless you want to resurrect something. But this is a lesson. Yes, this is like a wish. This is something, something brand new you can create. We got a court couple here. I mean, the two of you, it's like it's so cliche. It's the whole Jerry Maguire, you complete each other. I mean, you both came out on top of the Ten of Cups. So you're looking at someone as if they can be your wife, as you can create with an empress. If you're looking at them as an empress, this is somebody, this could be the one. You know what I mean? So it's like, you're not with this person. You're looking at somebody as marriage material. Staying optimistic, this could be the one. If this is the one, you're not married, you're not in a relationship. And if you are, then ugh, that's not good. Because you're looking at someone else as your next wife. You're in love with the Empress. You're in love with who this is. She had Ten of Cups. It's so cliche. It's like, you complete me, Ten of Cups, Jerry Maguire on the board. Like, what the frizzle sticks? It's, it's on you. Make the effort. Have the strength to move forward. You want a reconciliation? Go after it. You want a new start in love? Go after it. Talk about it. Wow. And you, out of all my zodiacs, are the only ones that didn't get the hermit. Shocking. Shocking. The sun. The loneliness. So it's like, here comes the sun. It's all around. It's like a tower moment. It's like a massive awakening. But you know what to do. You want how many? There's your Ten of Cups. Let go of the past. You got the Ten of Cups twice. Wow. You want how many in your life? Go after it. Opportunity to you. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Love you guys. Bye.